Towards a New Socialism. Section. Freedom of Choice. The second point is that, once the basic prerequisites of citizenship are provided, individuals, or families, or communes, should have maximum freedom to decide in what form they want to enjoy the fruits of their labor. State allocation, or rationing, is poorly adapted to this end. We need some form of market on which people are able to spend their labor tokens. As mentioned above, we describe such a market in Chapter 8. This mode of distribution would be used for food, drink, entertainment, books, clothing, holiday travel, and sh so forth. Goods where externalities are absent or unimportant. While it does not make sense for society to allow its members to fall into ignorance or unnecessary disease, or to be trapped at home with young children, it makes perfect sense to allow them to choose between caviar, wine, books, shirts, or trips to the highlands. End of section.